Okay, this is my last treat of the night, and this one, again, is save the best for last. This is a frozen yogurt with nothing but good stuff in it, and it's so simple. So what I have here are bananas, and all I did was slice them and stuck them in the freezer, so they're frozen solid here. So you put them in your food processor, break them up a little bit. Again, that's three bananas. I'm gonna add strawberries, and I never weigh them really, I just look at it, I don't know. So, a couple handfuls, maybe, let's see, three, six, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14. Let's say 15 strawberries, no, 16, there we go, 16 strawberries. And then we're gonna have, we're gonna add two containers of Greek yogurt and this one is strawberry with fruit on the bottom only because I'm running low on vanilla normally I would just I would just use two vanillas but since this is strawberry banana yogurt who cares And then I'm going to add just a splash of almond milk. And it's about to get crazy in here, so just bear with me with the, for the noise. I'm going to show you, you're going to have to do this several times. So I'm going to show you what you're doing here. So you're going to start it. Okay, I'm gonna pause it for a second, but it looks like my blade popped up, so I'm gonna have to take everything out. So I'll come back in just a minute and show you. Okay, I'm back. Note to self, I had to take everything out of here. Make sure your blade is all the way down before you turn it on. Don't be an idiot like me. At least you know this is uh, live cooking, right? Or dessert making. So here we go again. What's gonna start happening is your fruit's gonna start getting chopped up here. Get a close up of this so you can see. And what you wanna do is you wanna clear it away from the side. And stack it all there. And you're gonna to have to do this a few times before you turn this into amazing frozen yogurt. So we're gonna go at it again. Now you want to scrape all of your yogurt out of the lid here so that way it helps all this start to mix and then again we're going to scrape it away from the side and it's already starting to make frozen yogurt and this is so good the bananas um, really make this so creamy so we're going to go ahead again it just takes patience, but patience pays. Yep, we're almost there. See this, what we're getting here? It's like soft serve ice cream. Actually, it's a little firmer than soft serve right now. So we're gonna keep mixing it in. Make sure all those fruits get chopped up. So clear everything away from the side. And I think we'll have like one more go here and we'll be done. This looks so good already. check for 
for lumps. And we still got little bits of strawberries, little bits of pieces in there. But you know what? This is exactly how I want it. So this is what your final result is. Look at how nice and creamy that is. I mean, it's like professional stuff here. Looks like ice cream, tastes like ice cream, well frozen yogurt. You saw everything that went into it is good for you. And it's a healthy dessert that you can feel good about giving to your whole family. Um, one of the things that I like to do sometimes is I'll take um, the ice cream and I'll put some non-sweet chocolate chips on there, just a few, just because chocolate and strawberry always go together. But anyways, I hope that this was helpful and that everybody tries it because it's really, really good. So see you guys later. I'm going to go have some ice cream now.